This is Kia. Man, look at that blood. And this is Mars. Mm. What up? And together, and together we're, we're Kia Mars. Why are you talking like that? I don't know. This was the voice I just picked for today. Also, Ninja Gear, because, duh. Are you okay? Do you need help? All right, well, let's, let's play Dream Daddy. All right. All right. Last time, we were in a graveyard having a picnic. A picnic. A picnic. Picnic basket. All right. That's you. Oh, yes, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? I'm not sure. It noticed us. What's it? Stop. I'm paralyzed with fear as it begins lumbering toward us. Its shape taking more animal form, more feral. I look at Damien for help, but he's just as afraid and transfixed as I am. Oh, dear. I want to scream. But it's, tr but it's stuck in my throat. The creature is getting closer, moving faster. <gasps> it's a doggo! Bark! Oh. It's a doggo. It's a dog! Ah! Ah! Oh my god, it looks so stupid! Look at those stupid eyes. Just... It's a little Iggy. Yes, it's, it's like... It's a little Iggy. <laughs> it's a little Iggy. It's finally the coming The dumbest light. little the Boston friendliest, Terrier. dumbest little Boston Terrier I've ever seen pulls its owner toward us. The dog trots over to Damien and sniffs his hand. Damien looks ecstatic. Me. <laughs> he ruffles the dog's fur happily. Me. What a beautiful dog! Hey! We both look up, not expecting to see. Oh, wait. That's my voice. Thanks. <laughs> Robert, what are you doing here on this lovely evening? Hunting cryptids. Are we about to date him next? <laughs> We're fucking cryptids! Quite obviously. Uh, after fucking this cryptid. Playthrough? Cryptid. Cryptid. Am I putting in pictures of my cat? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> what? Hmm. What? Hmm. I didn't know you had a dog. This isn't my dog. I found her wandering the street. Aww. I put a leash on her, and now we're walking around this graveyard together. That's adorable. Hunting cryptids. <laughs> Damien and I share a look. May I give her a treat? Sure. Wouldn't give her cheese, though. Oh. Not to worry. Damien reaches into the depths of his cloak and produces a small dog treat. What else is he keeping in there? Oh, I love this. The dog laps up at the treat and crunches away. Tail wagging furiously. Never know when you're on a couch or a dog. All right. Damien continues to smooth down her fur. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Oh. My absolute pleasure. Damien shakes the dog's paw. Oh. Lovely to meet you, my friend. May our paths cross again. Robert and his dog <laughs> appear in the darkness again. Disappear. Disappear in the darkness again. Well, Hello, they, they said. <laughs> <laughs> Damien stares after them. I didn't know you liked dogs. Oh. Victorians love dogs, actually. Most Victorian women of high fashion would always be accompanied by a small dog, such as a terrier or a Maltese. Mm. I, uh, think big dogs are nice, too. I bet. Yeah, man. Stop. Dogs are cool. What does that mean? It means you I like stick. Oh. I do believe we've had enough excitement for one night. What say we make our way home and fuck in the butt? Damien hops onto his feet and extends a hand to help me up. I gladly take it as my knees aren't what they used to be, because I'm an old man. He packs the picnic basket and leads us down the, the picnic the basket. The picnic basket. The picnic basket. Yep. And leads us out of the graveyard. As we begin to walk home, I take one last look at the cemetery. It's really beautiful. Hmm. It is. Like a proper gentleman, Damien walks me to my doorstep. Please make out. Thank you ever so kindly for your company tonight. Damien, it was my pleasure. Jotro, if you'll allow me, it would be a great joy to offer you a token of my affection! Damien reaches into his cloak and pulls out a folded, monogrammed handkerchief. He presses it so into my touching. hand. This is so touching. I'm dying. Wow. Thank you, Damien. I'm going to wave this at passing ships. Yep. Oh. Ah, yay! I approve! Damien shuffles his feet. <gasps> I just want to say that it's rare to find someone like you, someone who's open to my eccentricities. It's nice to feel so accepted. Thank you. Damien gives my hand ah, a quick squeeze. It's okay. Damien blushes and hastily retracts his hand. Look, the dick satellite's back. <laughs> uh, uh, I must take my leave. Good night. Before I can say anything else, he's gone like a bat. At me. 
Uh, I unlock the door and step inside. I hope Amanda was there like, what up? Right. Yeah, like, there she is. Amanda <laughs> runs from the window and plops down on the couch, trying to look nonchalant. Hey, Dad, what's up? Were you watching me from the window? Ah. No, I was just, uh, mm. oh yes, I was a movie. Lots of vampire titties. Yeah. Well, I told you. But as it turns out, Damien is scared. Huh. Wait, Amanda doesn't need to know that. I'll keep it between me and Damien. Uh, scary, scary, cool. Yep, he's a cool. He's so school, so school for cool. Wow. But scary. Nice, yeah, nice save. <laughs> nice save, Jodoro. Do you know that uh, graveyards used to be places to throw parties? Huh? I think I'm misremembering that. Hmm. Wow, that's pretty punk. Also, we saw a dog. Definitely thought it was a werewolf for a minute, though. How can you be so sure it wasn't a werewolf? How can you be so sure I'm not a werewolf? I'm dick. How can you be so sure you're not a werewolf? <laughs> Amanda's eyes narrow. Yeah. I don't trust you. Nor do I, nor I you. Mm. We make intense, wary eye contact for a second. Mm. Anyway, I'm calling it a night. Don't stay up too late, will ya? I'll try not to howl at the moon past midnight. And then here's a part where there's probably going to be some really cool sound clips that we're not going to be able to hear, but everyone else gets to hear it. Right? We didn't get a lot of cemetery points. Oh, yeah, no. Look at that Edwardian. Man, look at all these points. Esrig! And he's probably saying My really stars, right this. Now, and I'm never going to hear it. Never in a million later, later. moons I have I had it. a date such as exquisite sure as this one. I want to make sure it went on for a while, so I want to make sure that I get to hear it in post. Okay, that's probably enough. Man, look at that blood. What? Oh. <laughs> Bonding was good, though. Cargo is short. We did our best. Darkness. We didn't do very good on the cemetery. What the What'd fuck? you do? I don't know. Don't tell me. Did it close? I think it closed itself. But you know what? It ended at the perfect time. So we'll come back to that. <laughs> no. I was going to say, having a bunch of technical difficulties sure is Kilmer's catchphrase, isn't it? Wow. Yep. I hate that. I worked it. And this. Mm-hmm. Bye. Bye. Why'd you do the extra clicking at the end? Because that's going to be hard for me. Because I was going to the get actually a dream daddy. Oh, sequence. just kidding. Never mind. Okay. I thought you were just being a dick. You're like, hey, click, click, click. I make sounds. <laughs> jingle, jingle. Jingle, jingle. I love sounds. You, you asshole. asshole. I love sounds. Jingle, jingle.